Now, Extreme E. Brilliant to see. Yeah, really cool. This is going to race all over the world, rainforests, ice caps, to try and highlight the, uh, the issues facing our planet at the moment. So, great to see her driving this Extreme E car. It was, uh, I mean, with this one, I, um, it's a beast, it's really a beast. When you give power, it's insane, and imagine all this going over the bumps that we're going to do on the different surfaces. I, uh, I can't wait to try it out. Okay, so obviously, I mean, with Formula E, now it's for me, you really have a fascination for electrical race cars. What do you say from your side? Why is that? I mean, I was in, let's call it normal racing combustion racing for many, many years. And I loved it and I still love it. Yeah. But at one point I thought electric cars can play a role in fighting climate change yeah. and in fighting city pollution. Yeah. And I thought with motorsport we could make electric cars more popular, mm. change the perception of our electric cars, yeah. and also improve the technology of these cars. So motorsport can really ch change the game for electric cars. That's how I started really pushing Formula E yeah. and now this new championship extreme. We will spread this message and we will raise this awareness. So that's what made us think of, of Extreme E and Gilles de Ferran actually came up with the idea, let's go to the oh, most okay. remote places. We were having breakfast in my house, brainstorming, and now you have the future of uh, off-road racing, which is Extreme e.